Hey everyone, just left here in, down here in the great city of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, where Surrealville City was born, July 4th, 2016. And one thing I love about walking around this, like the city, you know, New York, Philadelphia, and the major cities is, I always find really cool things and end up doing a few, at least one or two extra reviews. Every time I'm down in Philadelphia, like New York, I have a must-stop list. The Prince Center is on my must-stop list. Provided they're open. And stopped in, didn't realize, you know, didn't even know it was uh, their exhibits. But one that I really have to review that just floored me, okay? I was born in 1971, back in the days of the typewriter, then, brought, then more processors, computers, etc. And the, I actually have to check the program here for a second. But the type, Typographics, typewriter art as print, I'm not even gonna try it, as print exhibit, really floored me, caught my attention, screw this, and blew me away. Uncut, uncensored, unedited. The reason why is because I never, using a typewriter as a kid, then a computer, you know, um, in various, uh, Word editing programs, I never realized all the really cool designs that you could make from the from letters and symbols, the standard keyboard letters and symbols. And walking into this exhibit, I went up hit the main one, it came back down, I'm like, ah, this is the one that you gotta check out. That I want to review. Because and again, you have two different perspectives on this. The first one is you see the actual design that was intended for, that was actually intended, but then, you know, but then you go, you go up close, you see the letters and symbols that were used to create the design. So there's actually two different perspectives on each piece of art here. And it's like the possibilities are literally limitless. <laughs> and uh, and to only limited by your imagination. Now, it's just the two, the two different perspectives really give you, force you to see it in two completely different ways, which is what I love. Um, I love the, I love abstract art to begin with, and this exhibit really brings to the forefront that art in any form is truly not limited to any specific medium, and art is only limited to your imagination. In fact, I'm also a self-published author. This is something that authors out there, you might want to try it, play around with with some of the graphics for your books and even a book cover because you're art because you're already using because you're already using like Word or a word processing program to begin with. So you know, that'd be something like, something like for authors and writers to kind of expand expand uh, what they do and have some fun and also you know kind of kick in the creativity if you, if you hit writer's block. Definitely Prince Center is a must stop when you're down in Philadelphia. Really cool place. Cool exhibits, great people there. Down in Philadelphia, loving every second of it. Please go to thanks to the sponsors page. Check out the, the people and businesses and please support them. Without them, none of this could happen. Thanks to everybody out there for all the support. You have no idea what it means.